Thank you for joining us here on Mirror Now at this point in time. Our top focus, the battle with toxic air for those living in Delhi and its neighboring areas continues with the air quality reaching the hazardous category. The AQI is over the 700 mark in several parts of Delhi and Noida, making it nearly impossible for people to breathe. Now, in a bid to combat the vehicular pollution crisis, special shuttle services with e-buses are being arranged for government employees. The stage three of the graded response action is, place, is already in place and the water sprinklers and anti-smog guns have been deployed to tackle the pollution mess. Ishika joins me live on the broadcast now to give us uh, more updates and details from the ground. Ishika, what is it like to be on the ground reporting from there? Because it is uh, becoming nearly impossible for uh, people to breathe this toxic air, those living in Delhi and in the neighbouring areas, because the air quality is reaching the hazardous category in many parts of uh, Delhi and CR. Well, certainly, Riyanka, you know, working on the field in this kind of weather is also, you know, a no piece of cake. Right now, if we talk about the air quality index recorded in the national capital is 412. That means in the severe category. And as we are reporting here, even we can feel the symptoms. You know, our throats also are itching at the moment. Now, in fact, if we talk about the government, the government is saying that there are many steps, you know, that are being taken to curb the, you know, anti-industrial pollution if we talk about campaigns are being run and also schemes you know have been uh, done to curb the vehicular pollution but what do residents here on the ground are thinking i'll go across to one ma'am i want to ask you aaj agar hum baat kare to lagatar jo hai lagatar jo hai severe category mein bana hua hai air quality aap is pe abhi yahan par chemist shop se bahar aayi hain aapke uh, gale uh, mass hame dikhne ko mil raha hai kya aapko symptoms feel ho rahe hain जी हाँ मैं यहाँ एक हफ्ते पहले ही आई हूँ और मुझे डिफरेंस फील हो रहा है सफोकेशन सा होता है थ्रोट में इचिंग होती है कभी कभी आंखों में जलन भी होती है और ये सिर्फ मुझे नहीं मेरे हर उस घर वाले को होता है जो बाहर निकलते हैं अभी हम देखेंगे कि आपके पास मास्क भी है यू नो वी आर ऑल्सो ट्राइंग टू शो दैट यू नो शी इज ऑल्सो ब्रॉड मास्क विथ अ मैम अभी तो गवर्नमेंट ने कुछ एडवाइजरी जारी नहीं की है कि अभी आप लोगों को मास्क लगाना जरूरी है फिर भी हम देख रहे हैं कि आप मास्क खरीद के लाए हैं गवर्नमेंट एडवाइजरी जारी करे या ना करे लेकिन हमें जो प्रॉब्लम्स हो रहे हैं उनकी सेफ्टी के लिए उनसे निजात के लिए हम लोगों ने मास्क खरीदा है आफ्टर ऑल एक सिटीजन होने के नाते हमारी हेल्थ सिर्फ हमारी प्रायोरिटी नहीं है हमारी रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी भी है So certainly, you know, as you heard from the residents here, that you know it is certainly you know the citizens who need to be responsible at the moment because after all it is about their own health. But if we talk about on the other hand, you know, the governments of different states are are you know currently indulged in political bickering is what we can see at the moment because right now the Environment Minister of Delhi, Gopal Rai, has called for, uh, you know asked uh, the Union Environment Minister to call for a meeting with the. neighboring states because he claims that the rules that have been laid by CAQM are being openly flouted by them on the other hand the bjp has also attacked the delhi government with the bjp mp writing a letter to the chief minister arvind kejriwal and claiming that it is because of the chief minister's callous behavior that the residents of delhi are suffering and it is the time that he stops with the blame game and takes up the ownership and comes and implements those steps those measures that are actually going to bring some kind of relief to the residents here over to you All right, Ishika. Many thanks for uh, bringing us the details from the ground and also getting us the reaction of the citizen who are, of course, facing issues. Let's now uh, quickly take a look at these ground reports filed by my colleagues uh, Niyamika and Meeta. As the winter season is approaching, Delhi is once again slowly turning into a gas chamber. As the air pollution here in the national capital is continuously on a rise. Right now, we are standing at the heart of the national capital, which is Connaught Place, and behind me is a smog tower here. Unfortunately, this smog tower is 
dysfunctional and as you can see in the visuals as well that there is a lock which is being put up here at the gates of this smog tower however this was being constructed to help the government to, to uh, in in its efforts to curb the air pollution but this smog tower is not working right now and that is the reason why the politics has already been begun but before that i would also like to mention that the air quality index of the national capital has now reached to a very poor category at the aqi right now is 375 as per the data which is being given by the suffer app and you can see in the visuals as well that the aqi stands at 375 which comes under the very poor category and this is the smoke tower behind me which is not functioning right now the politics has begun as yesterday also we have seen that how the bjp has targeted the aam aadmi party government uh, for uh, this uh, rising air pollution as uh, the bjp is saying that no appropriate action was being taken on the time and that is the reason why the bjp spokesperson shahzad punawala had also come here uh, and uh, he had also shown that uh, the smoke tower is not functioning and despite of the fact uh, that uh, there were certain complaints which are already being made on the part of the bjp that no action was being taken on the part of the aam aadmi party still it is the same situation here there is no action which is being taken this uh, smoke tower is not functioning even today and that is the reason why the questions are now being asked by not just uh, by the bjp but even by the congress party as well which is in alliance with the aam aadmi party at the national level they are also saying that uh, the transportation system is completely collapsed in delhi there is no transport a uh, new transport which is being given on the part of the aam aadmi party government in delhi and they have just woken up in the month of october when there was already a rise of the air pollution in the national capital so i'm right now standing in noida one of the famous markets if we talk about noida the situation here is no less than delhi the severity of the air quality index is increasing every day but if we compare compare from yesterday the air quality index has slightly improved but still the situation and the severity of it is more or less the same the uh, health experts are advising not to step out of the homes until very necessary as it's causing various symptoms to people bahar nikalne se khansi aa rahi hai cough ho raha hai aur meri aankhon ke upar itching ho rahi hai jalan ho rahi hai jaise bahar nikal rahe hain office se bahar dar lag raha hai bahar nikalne se bahar nikal rahe hain to itching ho rahi hai khujli ho rahi hai aankhon mein dikkat ho rahi hai to iske wajah se eye drops leni pad rahi hai wo karna chahiye government ko kuch uske vatavarant thoda sahi ho iske liye I think there's everybody can see everybody can notice there's so much of pollution I think that the air suspend SPM is quite high right now and it is in a danger zone I think government should do something uh, in Delhi and Noida as well my parents have are already sick right now because of the pollution she has asthma and it's been increasing i started coughing and if you can see there's nothing been no plan of action has been taken it happens every year true but what do we do about but it's not only the government as humans we also don't do anything now meanwhile the political bickering continues over the rising air pollution in the national capital delhi environment minister gopal rai wrote to union minister bhupendra yadav requesting him to effectively ban the entry of vehicles non compliant of bs6 norms into delhi from uh, neighboring states and also to ban such vehicles in ncr as well Now in the letter Rai also requested him to convene an emergency meeting of neighboring states environment ministers including UP Haryana Rajasthan and Punjab On the other hand the BJP MP Manoj Tiwari wrote to Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal asking him to stop the blame game and protect the residents of the national capital who are choking under severe air pollution Delhi ko सरकार को पैरालाइज किया जा चुका है कानून बना करके केंद्र सरकार द्वारा वो जानते हैं कि चुनी हुई सरकार कुछ कर नहीं सकती और इसलिए वो इसमें सरकार के पैरालाइज करने में भी भूल गए कि ये हमारा निर्णय नहीं था ये सर्वोच्च न्यायालय का निर्णय था 13 जनवरी 2020 को सर्वोच्च न्यायालय ने निर्णय लिया था इसलिए हमने सी के माध्यम से एल साहब को ये भेजा हुआ है कि इस पर तुरंत एक्शन लिया जाए जो भी इसके लिए जिम्मेदार अधिकारी हैं इसे रोकने वाले उनके खिलाफ सख्त जो है वो कार्रवाई की जाए स्मॉक टावर शुरू किया जाए जो पेमेंट रोका गया है वो पेमेंट दिया जाए और इसकी पूरी रिपोर्ट सर्वोच्च न्यायालय के समक्ष रखी जाए ये इन्वायरमेंट मंत्री पूरे साल रहते हैं कि खाली अक्टूबर में रहते हैं 
तो अगर ये पूरे साल दौरे करते रहते हैं तो इनको पहले ही पता लग जाता कि क्या गलत हो रहा है क्या नहीं इसका मतलब अक्टूबर में ही निकलते हैं ना तो मैं ये तो यही कह रहा हूँ कि ये दोनों सरकारें तभी जागती हैं जब एकदम मुसीबत आ जाए अक्टूबर के अंदर इनको इन्वायरमेंट की याद आती है तो हमारा तो यही पॉइंट है ये तभी जागते हैं और फोटो ऐप कराते हैं फोटो ऐप कराने की बजाय पूरा साल काम करें तो दिल्ली के लोगों को दिक्कत ना हो